Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Ugh. This isn't even recycled paper. Victoria's not doing her part to save the Earth. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Juliet, read this. Horse. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana really does look stressed about all this. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. That looks like a home pregnancy test. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could There's rewind no and make it up to her. Max. So go. I said, please go. Max, enough. You are dense. Go. Max, enough. I said, please go. You are dense. Go. It would be a cool sticker without the words. This is both sad and pathetic. There's that damn flash drive. Ooh, Dana's Facebook wall is up and running. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. So fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. There's that damn flash drive. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? You're pregnant. 
I'm sorry, I shouldn't have. Yeah, me neither. But I did. Anyway. Oh. What about the other? That'd be Dad. You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Hey, Dana. Seriously. Dana. What? Nobody important. They just... It's like a goddamn reality show around. Of course. I... was pregnant. Was. Oh. That'd be Dad? Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. I better make sure everything is still in there. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. this shit. Ow! That hurt. 
Get Damn, lost, I better rewind. Not doing any interviews. Ouch, poor Alyssa. That'll leave a bruise. I can only go so far back in time. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Now that's what I call instant karma. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Bullies never change. That's why you're better off. They're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. I could almost feel sorry for him if he wasn't such a serious dick. Poor Juliet. I always get a little giddy when I think about having my own room here. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. You can't fool me. I know everything about this school. I cover the waterfront. So you better figure out what side you're on. Please, leave me alone. Hope you enjoyed the show. Thanks for nothing, Max. Man, I should have stepped in between Kate and David. That asshole was so over the line. I could rewind and try something different. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business?